Good afternoon, everyone. This is Empress Speaks. Uh, today is June 26, 2023. I would like to do a um, collective reading for Leo today. Um, also, I would like to thank everyone who has subscribed, who, who actually stopped by and either viewed, subscribed, liked my videos. I appreciate our little growing community from the bottom of my heart. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Hope everyone is doing well. Um, please keep in mind that this is a collective reading and it may or may not resonate with everyone. Um, take what resonates and leave the rest. All right, we've got some people in the Leo energy, uh, one feminine energy, one feminine that's in the energy, um, and she is in the King of Swords reverse, and it looks like um, this is a pretty dominant personality trying to create some upheaval in the home. The download that I got was just really uh, threatening the masculine in this situation with something regarding finances or letting out some secrets regarding misuse, misappropriation of money, finances. It could be related to a business. We certainly have some earth signs here, um, Taurus, uh, and uh, fire sign Sagittarius, Leo, or Aries. Um, so yeah, a lot of turmoil going on, a lot of threats being made in this energy, a lot of deceit and planning, conspiring. Looks like there may be more than one person involved in this conspiracy against this masculine. Uh, masculine has some issues of his own as well. Um, what I'm picking up here from the cards is that he is obsessing um, over someone he finds to be very attractive. Uh, a lot of sexual energy here. Um, the devil, the empress, uh, queen of wands, a lot of passion. Uh, we certainly could be looking at uh, Earth signs, Capricorn, um, someone with Venus in their chart, and um, water signs as well. So um, I am picking up on an unhealthy attraction and or obsession here. Um, so and I think there could be definitely a codependent relationship between this masculine and feminine. Uh, the masculine seems to be obsessing over someone he sees in, as in his empress, in the empress energy. And um, the feminine that he is with is just hell-bent on keeping him, trying to control him by any means necessary, um, and including um, threats and or, um, you know, towards exposing some, some hidden secrets or something of that nature. Let's see. In regard to the masculine, masculine in this reading, it looks like there is um, some avoidance. Of, or he's trying to avoid some arguments. Hold on, I just dropped my tarot cards. Uh, let me pick these up. It looks like there is um, some issues going on in his business. A lot of uh, dysfunction, a lot of uh, loss, and you know he is really trying to block a tower moment. You know, a lot of what's happening to him seems to be his karma for what is, you know, what he has done towards someone uh, or rejecting a blessing or something of that nature. And it looks like he's having a lot of of turmoil and bad decision making and he's trying to block um, ending of a cycle. We got the death card in reverse. Whole lot of struggles, competition, rivalry, tension. It could be in the workplace and outside of the workplace. Um, we'll get some clarification on that. And then we have you, Collective, um, in the King of Pentacles energy trying to determine, you know, what uh, direction to take. Um, you are in separation perhaps from a twin flame or soulmate and you're focusing on your rebirth and, and making decisions um, to create better stability for you. Okay, and we could be dealing with the Pisces um, as well as Leo doesn't have to be, could be and the last two cards that I got were temperance 
in um, the Five of Pentacles, it looks like you are trying to regain your stability and recover from separation or loss, uh, being left out in the cold um, and, you know, shunned away from someone that you deeply cared about. Okay, so it looks like you, we've got some things going on. You are looking very well. You're looking strong and focusing on building up your financial security, uh, healing from a separation. Um, you've got someone in your energy that is extremely obsessive, jealous, uh, a lot of um, sexual energy here, um, a lot of um, desire, passion and desire. And you've got uh, a feminine here that is losing her grip over the whole process. Perhaps she is feeling this masculine uh, pulling away from her and is doing all that she can to undermine him, um, blackmailing, threatening to expose secrets and other things. Okay, so we're going to clarify some of what's going on really quickly. Hope everybody's doing good this Monday. It's a weird Monday for me. Got, got some errands to run and I've been off to a slow start. But we're going to get on the right foot. All right. All right. We've got a mature male. who came in the reverse. We have sudden wealth in reverse. Courtship in reverse. Great fortune. We're just going to take these four and see what comes up on the download. Um, mature male in reverse. So this would indicate um, someone that's operating in a very deceitful and obsessive energy. And this might be what we picked up when we uh, did the tarot a little bit earlier, we've got a male, a masculine energy that's obsessing sexually over someone that he is very infatuated with. Um, perhaps it, it, it is a unhealthy obsession with a twin flame that he's in uh, separation from, but he is definitely uh, coming up as a mature male in reverse, sudden wealth in reverse. And also we, the number five could be significant or a may. Somebody could have been born in May or something happening in May. Um, sudden wealth and 11 could be significant. You might be seeing 11, 11. Sudden wealth, um, this card came up in the reverse. So we did pick up on a loss of money, a loss of fin a financial loss, something happening with a business or businesses, as well as um, financial dis depletion in the home, mismanagement or misappropriation of money or funds. Um, courtship in reverse, uh, definitely indicating that there is a separation, uh, and I mentioned or uh, picked up on a download, a union or, or courtship that is not coming into play, a rejecting a blessing. Uh, courtship in reverse could indicate that um, there is some type of stagnant behavior, stuck in stagnant behavior or action or inability to, to, to cause some towards some type of action to come towards another whether it's divinely guided or intuitively led but there is uh something happening that's keeping the masculine and feminine or these two uh from coming together and it may have something to do with uh the feminine energy that came up in the tarot reading a little bit earlier the number four could be significant or april the number 11 or November would be significant. You might be seeing 1111. And lastly, 26, great fortune. Great fortune. I am in, uh, we did pick up on this in the reading for you. Um, Leo, uh, looks like you were in your King of Pentacle energy. You're focusing on the uh, direction to take to secure your financial future or to continue to perpetuate building up of your finances and strength, uh, making the right decisions. So great fortune awaits you. Um, somebody could have been born on the 26th, right? Born on the 26th or 26th could be significant in some way. 
So again, this is a collective read. Take it as it resonates, all of it or some of it or even none of it at all. It's been a pleasure to um, read for you today. Thank you so much for stopping by. Uh, please like, share, and subscribe if you like the vibe. And peace and blessings to all of you. Thank you.